Forgot my headphones in a goddamn car. Fucking storm is coming. Speaking of storm, let me tell y'all about this shit. What it do, YTZ? It's your boy, Too Tall Bishop Jones, and you know what the f*** going on, man. Eh? What the f*** going on with y'all, eh? And welcome, welcome, welcome back to another story time. What the fuck is you looking at, bro? Fuck, take your monkey ass in the house. Welcome back to another story time. Y'all know when I'm out on my walk, I give y'all a nice little vibe to vibe with, you feel me? So... Like I said, speaking of storms, I'm gonna take y'all back in a day, you feel me? So, y'all know I'm from Baltimore, right? I'm living in Baltimore at the time. It's a huge snow blizzard. If y'all remember like a blizzard where it's though like the snow was like higher than the cars type shit, like it was that blizzard. So, probably I say two days before the blizzard, I had a little something something. I mean, I had a little something. The little tenderoni come through, you feel me? So the little tenderoni come through, she stayed a couple days. Mind you, we wake up the next morning and there's a fucking blizzard outside. Like, we thinking it's gonna snow a little bit. The shit came over my fucking head and y'all know I'm 6'9". So I'm like, this, 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 this motherfucker gotta get out, you know? So I'm like, how the hell you gonna get home? like? She's like, man, I can't drive in that shit. I'm like, look, we're going to have to push this motherfucker. Mind you, I'm living in West Baltimore. She all the way in East Baltimore. It's like an unbelievable trail. So, of course, she on some, it's a fucking blizzard outside. How I'm supposed to go home and all that. You trying to put me out? I'm like, listen, it's been two days and a half type shit. It's time to go. You feel me? End up couldn't leave that day. She had to stay another night. Now I'm pissed. But in the midst of that night, I started to get an itch. So I'm like, ain't paying in no mind at first. I ain't paying in no mind. So I'm getting me a little itch. I'm noticing her. She ain't really doing too much itching, but now and again. But I'm like, what the fuck? Something crawling on me or something? I'm tripping. Like, what the fuck going on? She sitting there, <laughs> she ain't saying shit. So I ain't thinking nothing of it. Next morning, I wake up with a bunch of rash all over me, red spots. When I say I'm trying to fucking scratch my fucking skin off of my neck, I'm like, yo, what the fuck? I'm trying to figure out what's going on with me. So I'm like, yo, something going on. I keep getting in the tub. I got my ass in the tub. Like I gotta get in water, like I can't stop. She like, I don't know what's going on, put alcohol on and all this. I'm throwing fucking bottles of alcohol on me. I'm itching like crazy. So I'm like, yo, I don't know what the hell going on. I'm still trying to get her out of my face because I'm mad that she even here this long. So I'm like, yo, I'm trying to think, how the fuck can I get her out of my house and why the fuck am I itching like this? I'm sitting there, I got a fucking light bulb hit. Bing, my fucking father. Now, my father, he like one of those, he an army veteran, real like, real live RoboCop motherfucker. He done did 10 wars and all that shit. Shout out to my pops, Junior. So, he got like a Jeep, right? And he put all this money into this Jeep for it to have eight wheel drive and all this. This shit can ride up a straight up and down mountain. I call him and say, man, where you at? Mind you, my father, he, he with all that shit. I'm like, listen. I got to get this young Teneroni out of my house. I need you and only you to be able to get through this goddamn snow. When I say my father said, I'm on my way. I don't know how, but that man was beeping the fucking horn in front of my house in about 10 minutes. He then ran through the whole snow that made ways for other people to drive. I'm like, oh yeah, you got to get your ass out. She sitting here, I can't believe you did all this trouble. I'm like, listen, when this snow melt, I'm going to bring you your car. You feel me? Don't worry about all that. Get your ass in there. I didn't even ride with her. I gave him my, the edge. I said, man, take her like an Uber. Mind you, this wasn't even no Uber time. I'm like, get your ass out of here. So mind you, I'm still itching like a motherfucker. 
So I'm like, yo, I don't know what's going on. Like, I cannot stop itching. So I'm sitting there, and out the corner of my eye, I swear I see something moving. So I look on my wall, the wall is white. I see a little black ass bug. So I'm thinking it's a fly or something. I go to smash the blood, uh, bug, fucking blood come out of the bug. I'm like, what the fuck is this? I'm like, this little, I never seen a bug that looked like this. I'm like, what is this? It's like dark blood. I'm like, so my, of course I take a picture of it cause I'm like, I'm confused. So I take a picture of it, send it to my sister. She said, she said, where is that at? I said, it's on my wall. What the hell kind of bug is this? She said, boy, that's a damn big bug. I said, oh my God. When I say, I was so pissed the fuck off. She like, who you had in your house? I'm like, yo, this shit ain't start till this girl came over here. She get to die laughing at me. I say, yo, the girl act like she wasn't even getting bit. Like, she got to be the best actress in the world to not act like a bed bug is biting you. She sitting there like, I'm all right. That's why I'm like, well, what could it be? Got me like this. Just thinking about it, I'm itching. Couldn't figure out why I was not itching. And then as soon as I seen that one on the wall, I start seeing them everywhere. So I called my aunt, try to figure out how the hell do I get rid of She said, man, it really ain't no getting rid of them. You gotta move down there. I'm like, so she like, uh, when did it start? You might, I might have caught it early and stuff like that. I show her a picture of, she said, yeah, they still small and all that. So we, uh, we uh, like saran wrap my uh, couch and all that shit. We bomb and fog everything. I had to throw all my clothes away. All that type of shit. When I say this girl act like she didn't even know what a bed bug was. That's what the girl act like. She didn't even know what it was. I couldn't believe it. My eyes, my ears. You don't even know what a bed bug is and you brought this shit to me? So I'm pressing up on her like, yo, why you ain't tell me before I invited you to the spot? that you got the bugs that lay in the bed with you. You feel me? You supposed to be a lady and you got bed bugs. At least, at least tell me, that's like having an STD. Like you got giving me the choice, like look, I'm burning. It's my choice to go in. If you got bed bugs and you come into my house, you don't think it's the right to say Listen, yo, I got the bugs that lay in the bed with me. Like, oh, am I tripping? So I'm dead ass, like, trying to, like, get it out of her, yo. Like, admit that, that you brought this shit here. Like, I never had this problem to you. Like, your first time and your only. So she not trying to say something. So I say, all right, bet. I say, bet. I got you. I get around her homegirls. What I do? Just shut up. I ain't had to say much. I said something about, I, I'm trying, where she at? I, I need, I, I should go over her house or something like that. I said, I just, I'm just talking about her house. They get to the snickering and looking at each other. I say, yep, got you. I already know what that means. Yeah, yeah. I say, Lord, shit. They say, mm -hmm, you don't want to go over there. Like, shit like that. Like, yeah, I already know. I know. She gave me them bed bugs, I know. Ha ha ha, joke on me, boy, I swear to God.